dear doctors and friends and colleagues, I'm talking, I'm going to talk about an issue which has been raising lastly in the last few years and gaining an importance, which is gestational diabetes. Gestational diabetes is a situation which happens to the ladies. It's a period of impaired glucose tolerance, which occurs during pregnancy for the first time. That's to say that the lady was not diabetic before her pregnancy. And this carries sometimes some morbidity changes either to the mother or to the fetus. Usually, we screen for those pregnancy at the 24 to the 26 weeks of pregnancy. We either have a one step, we take the patient fasting after 8 to 10 hours and make fasting and give 75 gram glucose and make after one hour and two hours. Either or we have another system, we call it two step test. The first step is to make a random blood glucose any time of the day after one after 50 gram glucose. If it's more than 140, we go to the second step. And the second step is a three hours blood glucose curve. Patient goes also from eight to 10 hours and receive 100 gram glucose and after one hour, two hour and three hours. This gestational diabetes in 50% of cases disappear after pregnancy because this gestational diabetes is due to the raise of human placenta lactogen and estrogen. The treatment of gestational diabetes is after lifestyle modification is insulin therapy. Yes, the target should be all the time glycated hemoglobin below seven or a fractosamine every three weeks less than 285 and the treatment is insulin therapy. We have another type which is diabetics which are getting pregnant. We plan for these ladies that their glycated hemoglobin before conception should be below seven. And when they are okay or below seven, we put them in a basal bolus and we should use a short acting insulin applied to the guidelines and a long acting one which could be used such as Glargine. We should follow the patient either with a glycated hemoglobin, fractosamine, or a short-term control, a fasting, two hours breakfast, two hours lunch, two hours dinner, and 3 a.m. Either or for delivery, the doctor makes an appointment because most of these cases deliver through cesarean section. Those with gestational diabetes, 50% of them diabetes will disappear. And those with diabetes and pregnancy, 50% of their insulin will decrease after pregnancy. Thank you very much.